Welcome, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm back, guys. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. All right, so we have a lot to talk about here. There's a lot to talk about. This is going to be a collective message, okay? So whoever needs this message is for you. Forgive me for my nails, guys. I know they're kind of ugly. I try to keep them out the camera. But let's jump into this, okay? Um, if you are new to my channel, welcome. I hope you click the bell to subscribe so you can get notifications for when I do go live and when I do uh, monthly reads, all right? As well, guys, this is a collective reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. If it does resonate, then this reading was for you. And if you would like to book your very own personal reading, um, to get in more depth and detail on your specific situation, contact me via email. That information is going to be in the drop box below. Currently, guys, I don't want to let you guys know that I am running a special, okay? I'm going back to my $44.44 special, okay? You're going to get two questions answered, and you get a bonus question for free, which is going to be answered utilizing the pendulum. So you get three questions answered, okay, for $44.44, .44, all right? If you want to book, that information is below, all right? Don't miss out because those slots fill quickly. All right, so let's hop into it, okay? Because I see some things here that I definitely want to talk about, okay? So uh, the first message card we got, guys, is mute, okay? We got mute. So somebody is being silent. Somebody is not saying anything. It could be you. It could be a partner. Um, but somebody is just being quiet. Like they're not communicating. They're not reaching out. Maybe you're reaching out to them and they're not responding or vice versa. Um, or you just can't get in contact with this person. Okay. And it could possibly be because somebody wants to take a pause. Okay. Somebody wants to pause, put this situation on ice. Okay. Somebody's trying to put something on ice and they're being quiet because they want to put this situation on ice and somebody wants to break free somebody wants free will and they feel like this is their free will they can do this if this if that's the decision that they want to make um they don't want to be forced into um making a decision or talking they're practicing being free okay having that free will um i do want to know who or why this person is like I want to I'm going to put a few more cards because I want to go a little bit deeper into uh, mute so this could be you or a partner doing this okay but somebody is like on a hush hush not responding or taking their slow time to respond but mute is just being straight up silent okay why is mute here or someone could be being silent okay yeah somebody is um uh, we got the seven of pentacles. So somebody is definitely being patient, like waiting, okay? Waiting something out here. We got the empress in the reverse. I'm getting like waiting. Oh, somebody's trying to keep somebody waiting. You could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus, and I'm even getting cancer here as well. But somebody is like holding back, is refraining from taking action. Because look at this, four of pentacles and the chariot. So somebody is definitely refraining from taking action. They're waiting this out. Somebody is like, you know, I'm just going to go, I'm just going to go silent, okay? I'm going to just go silent, wait to see what a reaction, what type of reaction I'm going to get or something to that nature all right so i do want to see why pause is here somebody is taking a pause somebody is sitting back somebody is done okay we got the ten of wands this is somebody dropping this okay and seven of cups okay for some of you this someone could have you know quite a few options but it's someone here possibly is trying to balance out their uh options okay why is why, why is the seven of cups here okay yeah someone's deciding that they want to walk away somebody is saying that they're done look the ten of wands is in the reverse the seven of cups is the decision and the eight of cups is walking away okay leaving this situation behind so somebody is being silent because they're they've made up their mind that they're done or they're trying to make up their mind 
on whether or not they are done. Because I see somebody wants free will here. Yeah, somebody wants to play. Somebody wants to play. Somebody is a player here. I got the sun in reverse and the knight of wands. Definitely someone who does not want to settle down energy. Somebody that wants to play and not be, you know, not take things too, too serious. Somebody is trying to be a player here. Okay, so somebody wants some freedom. Somebody is trying to get some freedom. They want some play time. And they want to put something on pause. Okay? Yeah, look at this. The devil. Look at that. Could be dealing with a Capricorn. But these three cards together definitely screams like <laughs> somebody is doing a lot of playing. Okay? Somebody wants to play around. Okay? And see where, where, where that goes. All right. So let's put that to the side and let's get into these to this read here well actually before we get into the read i did pull a few more other cards here so let's get into it let's get into this i'm not going to pull all of them at once but uh the cards that jump is wedding okay so someone here could possibly be in a long-term relationship or you've been with this person for a long time or someone here is possibly married um and is wanting to walk away from the, the marriage or considering walking away from the marriage but th like i said this could be like a long term you've been with this person for a while and now you're ready to free yourself okay some of you are trying to take back control of your life you want that free will some of y'all are tired of being uh feeling burdened tired of being in a situation that you feel like is no longer serving you and you want to free yourself you want to free yourself from this situation okay i feel like as well like we have wait and then we have no and then we have take action okay so the, i did notice that there was a, a period of a pause period like you're waiting or you or someone is waiting to take action like, maybe your intuition may be telling you no, not to take action, because take action here is in the reverse. Okay, so maybe you're uncertain about what you want to do or how you want to get out of the situation, but you just know you want out. <laughs> you just know that you want out, okay? But I want to let you guys know as well, we got protection. Call back your power. A lot of this has to do with power and calling back your power and making yourself feel powerful. Like this situation may be burdening you emotionally, um, may be burdening you mentally. Some of you may just want out. You want your power back. Like you feel powerless in this situation um, and you want your, you want your uh, power back. You want to call back your power. Some of you actually need to go get some protection. Possibly like a pepper spray, taser, a gun license, um, spiritual protection. Some of you actually need to get that type of, take that stuff, okay? So let's see what else we got here. Let's jump into the read, okay? So the first card that jumped out, guys, we got the judgment. It's in the reverse, okay? So there's a decision that needs to be made. Okay, there's a final decision that needs to be made. And for some of you guys, it could be involving a water sign, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I got Queen of Swords here as well, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And I also have uh, Temperance, which is Sagittarius' energy. I feel like you're, you can't make up your mind on whether or not you want to uh, make up your mind about this relationship. I feel like there's a, a relationship that's possibly going sour here with this two of cups reverse. Um, things may just not be going how, you know, in your favor. And we got the queen of swords. So some of you want to cut, you know, cut ties, cut the cord on this. Okay. And a lot of you are looking for peace, inner peace. Some of you just feel like, you know, I'm trying to find balance back. I'm trying to get balance back into my life. This situation here is just no longer serving me. And it looks like future energy, some of you are going to decide to move on, okay? To move, move to another city, move to another state, move to another home. 
You know, some of you are leaving and going to calmer waters. I see this here with the temperance being you want some balance in your life. You want peace. Because this situation here is a two of cups reverse. You and this person aren't seeing eye to eye. Okay? You're not seeing eye to eye. What else the judgment card here? Lots of waiting. You're waiting on uh, this this conversation. Seven of Pentacles, Seven of Page of Cups. Waiting on somebody to ask, what do you want to do? Or you're waiting for this person to have a face-to-face -face conversation with you about not being happy. You're waiting for this person to say, hey, you know what? I'm not happy in this either. You know? So you guys can come to a final decision. Because I feel like, yeah, you look, look at this. Somebody's tired of um, this... <laughs> this tower energy the tower is a big energy like this thing's just happening out of the blue you know shocking things there could be physical altercations it's just stuff that's just that just happens that does not need to happen and i feel like some of you guys are feeling like this like i'm tired of this bs i'm tired of it could be dealing with the king of cups pisces cancer scorpio why is the two of cups reversed? Page of Pentacles. Yep, see, somebody's saying that they want their freedom. Somebody wants to be free. Somebody wants to be free, no doubt. Like, somebody wants a brand new start. Want to start fresh. Yep, see, look at this. This is about not having control, okay? Like, you, some of you feel powerless in this situation. Like, yeah, see, look, Ten of Swords, yeah. And then, you know, this tower and the Ten of Cups reverse. Like, and then the King of Cups. Look, some of you are dealing with somebody who's extremely emotional. Like, they're emotionally draining. And this is just with the Ten of Cups, Ten of Cups reverse. It's just not, you don't want, you, you're not trying to deal with that anymore. You're done. You're trying to find balance. Yeah, see, look, the moon, balance your emotions, okay? Like, when someone gets mad, they, like, they do too much. They do too much, okay? Someone here is not putting in the effort to be a man, the man that you need, or vice versa. But I got very big masculine energy here with the emperor and the king of pentacles, Okay, and somebody keeps failing, like they keep failing at whatever it is that you want them to be, they're not rising to the occasion. Okay, so you're you're to the point where you're ready to cut them off, Queen of Swords. You're ready, yeah. You'll be by yourself. You, you, I feel like some of you want, uh, want to be you know single or alone and like to find you. The Hermit card is definitely going on a soul journey to find yourself, okay? We got the Six of Swords, which is moving on, leaving a situation behind. This is, could also be letting, you know, just letting things go. But I hope you guys aren't letting, just letting things slide. If you're unhappy, go, go make yourself happy. And that's period. Six of Swords. Mm-hmm. See, some of you wanting to plant, look, some of you planning on leaving this toxic situation behind. Okay, you plan on leaving this situation, okay, because you just lost faith in this. You you no longer you don't have any faith in this situation anymore. Okay, you're you're done. There's nothing left here. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Yeah, you've been being strong. Okay, you've been being strong emotionally. You're trying to be strong about this emotionally. Um Yeah, look at this, the Empress. Okay, you're trying to be so strong, and I feel like you're done with this situation. A lot of you guys are going to be leaving things behind and starting fresh, but it's a, so beautiful because it looks like it's a self journey. It doesn't look like you're you're wanting to walk away from a situation because of um, you know somebody else said this or there was a third party or you know no it's it so to me looks like it's like uh you know this chapter has closed like you know on to the next i'm ready for something new i'm ready for my freedom you know i'm, I'm so loving it 
Loving that energy, all right? So if this message resonated with you guys, leave me a comment below. And I will chat with you guys later. Ciao.